I'm in my daughter 2006 BMW. It's a 530i. So I'm going to get straight to the point on how to reset this service engine soon. This light right here. And it's real simple to do, so I won't waste your time. So let's, let's start from scratch. I'm going to go ahead and turn this off. And I'm going to take the key out. So what you want to do is put your key in. And do not hit your brakes. You just want to hit this button and turn it on. So once you do that, the only thing you have to do is come over here where this reset mileage, you want to hold it for about five seconds. Okay, and then you have your different displays. You got, if you don't push nothing within five seconds, it's gonna start all over again. So every time you push it, like that's the front brakes. I think that's the coolant. You push it again, you got your back brakes. You got your spark plugs. So let's reset this. So first you wanna hold it for like, and you hit the reset, let it go, hold it again. And you see it reset itself. That's all you have to do. If you wanna reset something else, uh, just go through the same process. Say for instance, you're on, you wanna hold it. And I already reset this, so it's not gonna, do anything it's just gonna say okay so that's all you have to do say for instance you want your service just push it and hold it until the reset come up and then you push it and hold it again and that's it it resets everything so now what we want to do and crank your vehicle up Okay, I cleared everything, but my service engine light is still on. Let me show you the reason why. Because if I go here, I'm gonna hit the enter button right here, and I'm gonna go to service. And you notice that uh, if I go up, uh, it says service is required, I'm gonna hit that. Everything's okay, the uh, state inspection, the engine oil, brake, brake fluid, everything. I put some cooling in because it was low, but I'm gonna go here to the top and show you why it's still on. So I'm gonna check control um, messages. Before I had the cooling low, I just put cooling in there so it's not gonna show. My problem is a restraint system malfunction. That's the seatbelt, there's some kind of problem going on with it. So if you look at my service engine light right next to it, it have that seat belt. So it's gonna continue to stay on even though I got everything else reset. So I'm gonna have to go and figure out how to reset that or take it to BMW to get them to fix that. That's just more money, but everything else is fine. If you wanna go through and reset, just look at this video on how to reset your brakes and all your service lights and everything. So once you do that, like I said, you can go up here you notice that all of mines are green. If y'all scroll through everything, everything has been reset. All right, if this video helped, subscribe to my channel and have a great day. Thank you. Don't forget to subscribe, like, turn on your notifications and share this video. Also leave comments. Thanks for watching, welding and stuff.